Hello everybody, I'm Duke, and welcome back to Let's Play Halo. So in the last part, we blew up the second generator, and the tunnels below. Funnily enough, I have an episode named that. Go I watch located it. the Pillar of Autumn. She put down 1,200 kilometers up spin. Energy readings show her fusion reactors are still powered up. The systems on the Pillar of Autumn have fail-safes even I can't override without authorization from the captain. We'll need to find him, or his neural implants, to start the fusion core detonation. That tunnel leads to the next section of canyon. The final pulse generator we need to destroy is through there. Okay, look out for this guy. He has a rock launcher. And him too. Time to go get another banshee. I'm not flying through there on one health. So, yeah. Bad things can happen, but we're going through the tunnels. <clears throat> and you heard Cortana. No, 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 no. But I didn't get to mention that <clears throat> every time you come out of there, a new banshee will spawn on this side of the platform, which is kind of useful if you went in with a uh, low health banshee. You can see it in the top left corner. There is a banshee health meter. It doesn't give you that for ghosts, though. Actually, no, it might. Man, banshee health goes down really quick. I got hit with one assault rifle bullet, and I'm gone down. Oh great, it's broken. <clears throat> Sorry about the long lapse of silence. But considering the music is always epic. So yeah, you can't get the banshee through there. Uh, but... Nevertheless, my advice is <clears throat> uh, well, don't get totally scuppered. <clears throat> Just, um, I'm having a hard time. Oh, yes, yes, I remember what I need to commentate. I don't have a list. I just think it's slightly funny to say that. And now, of course, I'm lagging because Bungie just spawned a hundred and one infection points at me. So, uh, sorry about the fact that I only got two of the three videos I recorded yesterday uploaded. Um, but I was out doing stuff with my friends and the export. I, I didn't get to start it right away. But, at least I was doing stuff with my friends, right? Badness, badness, badness. I have a rock launcher, but it's on full ammo. So. Stop shooting me. swinging at me. I need to find some more ammo before I get completely screwed up. Alright then. This episode got off to an interesting start.
Oh, no. Alright, sorry. You didn't hear that because uh, my microphone sucks and I'm not sure how to make it record game sounds and sounds from my other microphone because it just didn't work when I tried it. Uh, it was weird. Man, I really miss the tank. Because remember when we went through that one, we had the tank. In episode Tank Ownage. Go watch that one, too. Man, this episode's getting self-referential. And look where we are now. We're back down underneath the two bridges from last episode. And I believe... That's the next pulse generator over there. No, it can't be. It wouldn't be that easy. Final run. Yep. Listen. Oh, that is the pulse generator. Now remember, we haven't heard this track since... The level and episode Truth and Reconciliation. Eat it. Oh man, not having target lock sucks. But you can zoom in at least, so. Uh oh. Badness, badness, badness. Okay. So, other people are probably on a little bit better statistics than me. Hopefully you all have better ammo if you're playing wrong. And if you're just playing and watching fail, well, I'm glad you're surprised there isn't much fail in this. I think I've died twice in the entire Let's Play. But, so, I'm just going to go around here. Stop shooting at me. I can't even hit him. Oh yeah, the music's cool. Okay. Out of concentration mode, back into commentative mode. I can't do anything because I'm out of ammo. Crap, I think that guy has a rocket launcher. This is not proving to be any better. Oh yeah, this is bad. Sorry. Okay, he didn't shoot his comrades. My shields aren't recharging. No oh, crap. You ass bag. And I got shot to death. Congratulations, Master Chief. Come on, respawn already. Okay, so... I completely forgot to look at the timer, so this episode is probably long, because right now it's short, right? to be something I can salvage around here somewhere. Because being on no shotgun ammo is really, really bad for my chances of survival. Maybe if I sneak around behind the Covenant? This is ultimately bad for me. Because they hadn't even invented weapon crates yet. I really don't want to use this as anti-personnel, because it will probably go worse for me than it would for them. Because, I mean, it's anti-tank.
Uh, just don't. Just don't. I have no ammo, but I can deal. Alright, fuck the shotgun, fuck the shotgun, grab it, grab it, grab it, run! Nope! Get in the ghost! Go, 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 go! Suck, 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 bad, bad, bad! Get in! Get in the damn thing, go! <clears throat> Sorry. Oh look, you do get it for the ghosts. I just don't usually use a ghost in campaign ever, so it's the first time I've noticed that. Here's where all our ammo is. <clears throat> Too bad we dropped the shotgun. Eat energy infused crystalline projectiles. Despite the fact that this defies pretty much all of Newton's laws. Does this thing have a 16 round trick? For a submachine gun, that's pretty bad. Nope, it has a 20 round clip. I don't even have a shotgun. Alright, those two guys have rocket launchers, so... Parkour time. So, yes, what you're, what, yes, what you're gonna want to do is jump on this rock and get up here. And then there are banshees over there. Okay, so I know the episode might actually be long by now. So, yeah, I'm, I'm really sorry. I'm really stupid. And yes, I know we're walking away from it, but we have to get a banshee to get up to it, remember? Yep. We're gonna have some badness. Alright, I'm just gonna hide behind this rock and end the episode. So, it's either long or it's short. But until the next one, I've been Duke. Halo, see you all in the next video. Bye bye!